Hello everyone, in this video we will talk about 7 important notes for Spooky 2 Scaly users. 1. Tune before each treatment. The tuning point may vary each day according to the temperature and humidity, as well as the layout of the machine. When Spooky 2 Scalar in operating, it becomes part of the environment, working in harmony with the surroundings. The process of tuning Spooky Tooth Scalar ensures optimum results. Learn more factors that can affect tuning points and how to know Spooky Tooth Scalar is tuned correctly from Spooky Tooth Scalar tuning. 2. The transmitter and receiver should have their lids facing each other. The reason for this configuration is so the signal does not go over the top of the coils in the box. We highly recommend this placement of the lids to run the scaler. It may work if positioned differently, but it is not at its most efficient position. 3. Keep the link cable between the transmitter and receiver away from metal. Please do not roll the cable if the cable is long. Metal absorbs the energy flowing through the link cable, reducing the signal strength. The optimum frequency will change as a result. 4. Use the transmitter tuning light for tuning. The receiver light can be used to confirm that a scalar field has been established. After tuning, turn the receiver light on. It will illuminate when the scalar field is present. The receiver light only needs to be dimly lit. It does not need to be at its brightest intensity. Turn the receiver light off during scalar treatments, as it takes energy from the scalar field. 5. Drink plenty of pure water. Ideally, you should drink 6 to 8 pints a day, half of it before noon. The water flushes toxins and dead organisms out of your body more quickly and it improves your electrical conductivity. If you feel nauseous, faint, dizzy or have flu-like symptoms or headaches after exposures to scalar field, please drink lots of pure water or lemon water and shorten your future spooky to scalar session times appropriately. 6. It's best not to share the scalar field with anyone who has a serious illness. 7. People who are pregnant or have a pacemaker should not use Spooky2 Scalar. Hope these notes can help you get the most out of your Spooky2 Scalar. Thanks for watching this video.